Hey guys. Okay, so before we start this vlog, honey, it's two pants right there. Don't say nothing because it's only gonna be there for a few clips. So as you from today's title, this is gonna be a preparation for my 18th birthday vacation. So right now it's like 9 20. I need to take a shower, wash my face, and get ready to go because I have a last appointment at 10 30 and I'm 40 minutes, 45 minutes away. So when I'm in a car, I'm gonna be um talking to y'all about the freaking situations on all this stuff so let me just hurry up and go ahead and take me a little quick shower and i'll see y'all when i get out because i'm a little bit upset okay so the last time i spoke to y'all it was like before i got in the shower and i look the same like i did like an hour but i did and i'm in the car now i had just lost my wallet i couldn't find my wallet my wallet got my cash my driver's license and everything in there to pay the girl i just be collecting change i don't even know how much cash i had but if not, I can catch it, right? I can tell y'all what has been happening to me for the last 24 hours, and it's crazy to me because my birthday is on the 3rd, today is the 30th, and tomorrow I'm doing something, okay? Our celebration is going to be the 1st, which is tomorrow. At the roundabout. So I booked all my appointments because I wanted to have everything set in place so I can have everything um already ready because I have a problem with procrastinating, okay? So I decided to go ahead and do all my stuff. At like the stop sign. Take this shit to the post office. Anyway, that's true. In one mile, <laughs> turn right onto State Route 42. <laughs> so yesterday, I'm like, okay, it's the night before my appointment. It's the 29th, and I need to get all my stuff done. I need to get my address so I can set my alarm to when I would need to wake up. So I texted the first appointment of the day, which was a freaking um, lash for me in this city that I'm in right now. That's where I used to live at. So it's in this city. I booked everything over here because I was going to be in my dad's house. So I was like, oh, I can get everything done there and then just go straight to Kenneson, right? To pack and do all the other stuff I got to do today. So she decides to text me back and she says, oh, hey, love, um, I'll have to reschedule because I just had a death in the family. What day works for you? Which is fine because she doesn't know that this is for a trip, not just, I'm not like a regular lash um, loyal customer or whatever. And so I'm like, oh, I'm sorry, but this was for a trip that I won't be in town next week to get them rescheduled. Um, the, the last was specifically for the trip. And she was like, oh, At the I'm light, sorry, turn right onto State Route 42. For one, motherfucker, I'm a last check as well. So I understand what you want, what you, what you mean by no In reason. a quarter mile, turn but left onto Bill Gardner Parkway. It, and the customer did not do anything. They need their money back. Period. That's it. Period. The rules, the policy. Cause she kept trying to throw that shit in my face. The policies, bitch. The policies is made up by the one and only you. So at this point, you could break your rules anytime. Cause I could break my rules anytime. Corporate is not gonna fire me. Corporate is not gonna fire you because you are your own. At the light, boss. turn left onto Bill Since Gardner then, Parkway. So then, so then, um, when I told her it's the income, when I explained to her what I just said, it's the inconvenience for me. I didn't do nothing to you to the point where I don't deserve a refund. I didn't mess up your plans. I didn't mess up your time to do other people's lashes to get you more money. In half Mind a mile, you, her, turn um, right to merge onto I-75 North. And full, and full, guys. I didn't even do a positive. And I was like, understandable, because she'd been doing lashes a long time. Maybe she got scammed on her money a few times. But obviously, I don't know. So she tells me she'll give me 50% of the refund. I'm like, okay, for whatever, I understand. At least I got some of the money, baby, baby. You keep the rest of the money. Sorry for your loss. Okay, my gift to you. That's what I said to her. I said, um, after she gave me refund, because I was gonna say that because she, then she wasn't gonna send me for reason. I got 4750 bags. I should send after she sent me that I texted her and I said, sorry for your loss. I said that you needed the money, so I'm gonna let you have it for the heart. Like I be killing people with kindness. Like, what can you actually say? So then she texted back and was like, Well, I just went over my policies to be nice to you. What do you mean needed? The policies, yet again, what I say. Bitch, you made them damn up. So I sent her a message and then I blocked her. I said, well, the policies are made up by you because this is your business. It's not a corporate job, so you won't get in trouble for bending the rules. And then I said, if you really want this to be nice, you would go ahead and give a 100% refund because you know the customer did not cost any of this. If you didn't, no, I said, if you didn't need the money and you really want it to be nice, you will have sent the 100% refund because for one, you got it like that. For two, the customer didn't do nothing. So why do they not need their refund? You know what I'm saying? I get it. Stupid fuck! Ooh, I'm sorry, it just always happens when I'm filming. Turn right. 
I'm not gonna say what I'm gonna say because y'all be on my ass, but y'all, if you know, you know. Because if I was in her situation as myself, that customer is getting their money back. Period. I would have said the reschedule just like her, but once they tell me this is specifically for something, in it. This is not about me. This is really about you. You wanted a service from me. I didn't want a service from you. So you don't need to not really feel bad for me, but you don't need to, um, what's the word? Basically give up your time because something happened to me. You know what I'm saying? That's just the kindness that I have in my heart. I'm not money hungry. Money does not control me like how it controls a lot of other people. Like you can have your $95 back, especially if I didn't do your service. Like, what the fuck? I mean, like, it be nail text that do this. It be lash text. All fucking text do this stuff. And it kills me all the time. I just don't understand it. I just don't understand it. And when I got into the field myself, I still don't understand it. I understand when a person cancel on you. That's annoying. But when I cancel on someone, and I don't want to give them their money back. Anywho, so that's apartment number one. Because I last night, I texted the last night. Once again, last night I texted the nail uh, appointment because the nail appointment was supposed to be at 12. So see, I had an, a, a last appointment at 9, a nail appointment at 12, okay? And they're like 10 minutes away from each other. So I had my time out, like ready to go. I had my whole day planned, okay? So um, I texted her. She didn't text back to, well, she didn't text back last night. I sent her a message this morning. She said, hey, love, I'm sorry. I rescheduled everyone's a fucking appointment for but back one to three days because my shipment didn't come. Um, and she real nice about it. She gave, she's gonna give me my deposit back. Even when I first booked, I booked on the wrong day. She said she'll give me my deposit back. And I said, oh, sorry, I booked the wrong day. And we rescheduled to, to, to today. And she thought, she probably thought she would have had her uh, supplies. So, I ain't tripping off the nail tech because she handles her business way, way, way better than this girl. The girl that didn't do my lashes, that was going to do my lashes, I actually went to her before my first time ever getting an extension. And she had my eyes burning, but I thought maybe this has been two years, three years later, honey, you probably would be way better. But maybe that's just got um, help it because no way. No way. No freaking way. But you never know when it comes to people, you know? People just do anything. I'm with this girl because she actually took my appointment and she did Demi. I don't know if y'all know who this, that is, but this girl is a her name Demi Licious, I think. Um, she, they did it. She did her lashes and her lashes look good for her birthday. This is just for Cancun because I know that when I'm like getting up, I don't want to put lashes on, or if I'm getting in the water, my lashes are gonna fall off. But I need to be looking cute at all times, baby. And I put the volume set, like I never got volume lashes before. I like my dad. I'm right now. I mean, I'm gonna let y'all know when I get there safely so I can know that the girl has made it. Hopefully, I don't come back with no new news, honey, because I'm gonna be mad. Yeah, <laughs> okay, guys, I made it to the appointment and gonna just go in hopefully this go by fast hopefully ain't nothing crazy i'm gonna see how i get back hopefully <gasps> uh -uh, i'm gonna have a last call anyways oh my god hopefully it go by great though but i'm gonna see y'all um when i'm out all right So I just got done with my lashes as you can see. Um, I have a few things to say. I don't really like the lashes that she used. They're like kind of not mink. They're like plastic looking. And they're too long. So there's that. I don't really, you know, like them. But it is what it is. I mean, I don't really have thick lashes, so I should have just not, I don't know, whatever. But at least we got one thing. Y'all see these lashes? I don't have a lot of lashes, okay? But these, they look stacked. Y'all probably don't know what stacked lashes is, but that's when they like just thrown on there. Like, not um, very good isolation. She was new though. I can't see if a car come in. Whatever. But do y'all see? So I'm gonna cut the ends. I'm gonna try to cut the ends because it looks like she went from like a 20. Oh, fuck no. In three quarters of a mile. Yeah, it's just these lashes are like plastic. I don't know what these are. They don't feel like the lashes that I use. Uh-uh. Pen -uh. chat, whatever. But I'm going to cut them. And the girl, one of the girls that I asked to do my nails, she can't do them. And then the other girl responds. She said she'll let me know at 12, but it's 1. 
So probably that's a no. Ooh. Everything's going wrong. So I might don't know what I'm gonna do actually. Yeah, this video is killing. Killing! Bruh, but okay, um, I don't wanna talk too much on y'all because y'all wanna see me prepare, so Whenever I get to my next destination, that's when I'm gonna see y'all. Yo, these lashes is terrible. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do with these hoes. See, they don't look bad far away, like how I'm seeing me. Like, I look like I could pass. But when you get close to these motherfuckers, that is when you see the true identity in the life. Okay, guys. So, it's like hecka, hecka, hecka hours later and... We are back. We are back. We are back. We are back. Oh my. Okay, guys. So, y'all see all that distraughtness. But now we are into the real good, happy part of the video because I got my lashes redone and look better. This size honestly looks better on me versus that, you know. Um, it looks good with a filter. But when you see me in real life, it was like spider legs. So, we wasn't going for that. We wasn't doing that. We wasn't gonna, we wasn't gonna be okay with that. And that's on. Period. Let me stop playing. So I'm back here in the side. As you can see, this is my apartment where I stay. Where I be. It smells so good in here. But it stinked downstairs because the trash was left in the uh, trash can. I didn't think it was going to stink because it was not nothing in there. But obviously. When you cook breakfast, guys, take the trash out. Okay. So, let me go ahead and show y'all my suitcase. Oh, another thing. I never found nobody to do my... Wait, like, I found somebody to do my nails now. But the whole day, I couldn't find nobody to do my nails. I was crying. I was very upset. My lashes were so ugly. Too heavy. Like, my eyes... Y'all seen them. My day was like this. But now I can, like, open my eyes and be, like, joyful and stuff like that. So, I get my nails done tomorrow at 12 p.m. here in Kennesaw. So, I'm chipping. I'm chilling. I ain't chipping off of that at all because it's right up the street. What else I'm doing? I'm getting my wax tomorrow. And I just bought a new SD card. So, this is new. <laughs> so, on my, on my uh, schedule that I had today, I wanted to have lashes at 10.30 a.m. That didn't work. We're just going to check it off. Make wax appointment. Then do that. Then do nails. Didn't get a wax, didn't wash my hair, didn't shower, shave, and mask, didn't break down, didn't nothing. Because that's what, we, oh, it just scared me. That's what we're supposed to be doing here. So, first things first, I'm going to get my, my nails and my wax tomorrow, like back to back. Tonight, I'm going to go ahead and take a shower, wash my hair, and do my shower, shave, and, maxes, and waxes, I mean mask. Um, I took a shower today already, but we're just going to take another one because we need to get all these things out of the way. I'm going to shave my legs. All that, all that. Um, should I do my hair tonight or should I just go ahead and do my hair tomorrow? I'm gonna do my hair tonight. We're not gonna keep talking. I think I need to just go ahead and start this before it gets too late. It's already 9.50 and I'm gonna eat me some noodles for dinner. It's already 10, so yeah, we need to get this uh, all out the way. Look at my hair, y'all. So I did the little headband wig. Uh, let's just go ahead and get into this hair, honey. Japan. You guys, like, I'm finally done, but look at the outcome. I have not, yo, this is terrible. I need to clean it now, but this is what I'm putting on. But I have not actually washed my hair like how I did today in a long time. I feel nasty with my hair like this. But anywho, here is my band that we have all my little stuff in it. Um, So this is, I bought like a heck of these from the beach class store by my mom's house before I had moved out. Well, I didn't really move out before I left. I just love it. So we're going to use it. I had used Noxzema on my face already, but this basically like brightens, well, it's say it right there, brightening sheet mask. That's what I'm going to use on my face. And I don't even have nothing else in here except this real smell good lotions, but I'm not wearing, I'm going to wear that tomorrow. But anywho, I'm so excited. I haven't used one of these in a long time. The last time I used this was on my channel. Okay. I don't know. I think I had a little glow up. It was like maybe when quarantine started. So what, March 8th. But I don't know if this like cleans. It says our product contains high quality ingredients such as argan oil that are proven to help purify and brighten your skin it will reevaluate the skin allow moisture blah 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 and it does just that well as much as i can remember but I, all i did today was leave noxema on my face my whole entire shower and the shower was like 40 minutes because i had to do my hair so here's the mask lock of face it'd be so cold i have to get it through my eyes oh 
I don't know who face this big, but ooh, it's so cold. So I can't breathe. It's, it's over my nose, but this one look like on, and you leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes. Like I put it on everything. My eyebrows be breaking out. This pimple, I could feel it. Alright guys, so I'm gonna see you guys in 10 to 15 minutes. I I might start braiding my hair, so my hair might be halfway braided. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take it off. And then, uh, I think I'm gonna go ahead and pack. Oh no, but let me take this off my face. Ooh. You just pat it. You pat it dry. And my pimple ain't gone, bro. Look brighter? I know. You don't gotta tell me, honey. I know. I know. Um, I was on live not too long ago. And pretty much all this boxes right here is all my Shein clothes. That's for my vacation. Bow. And that's some extra stuff at the top. And so they say it's going to be raining. So I'm going to bring me some extra clothes. Like some sweat stuff and stuff. Just in case. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and set my ring light up. Set my tripod up. And we're going to get to pretty much packing and trying. Nah. I think I'm going to just try everything and show y'all it like real fast. Everything. Then y'all going to be packing. So. <laughs> I'm so excited, like I'm really going to Cancun, y'all. I'm really going to Cancun. Okay, so here is the area. I'm gonna just move this stuff. So this is the actual box with majority of this. This is the stuff. Oh, so let me put it in the bag. And let's get to trying it on. Okay, here's outfit number one. I don't have no jewelry on or a bra on, so I don't really know how I'm feeling about this. Mind y'all, my hair gonna be done by the way, but I don't know how I'm feeling. It's like the shoe or the purse. Let me add shades. I'm not lying. Wow, just imagine my hair done. Okay, so here's the next outfit. Um, you know I don't have to wear the hat, but I just have it on, and I just put these on because I need. I don't have. I haven't found the shoes I'm gonna wear with these. I have these. But this is bedazzled, and that's just not, no, so no. Okay, this next one is for ATV. Oh, I don't know if y'all can see my shoe. So this is the shoe. I got these from, um, Champs not too long ago, just to go with this outfit. That was like $60 on sale. And yeah, this is the outfit. This is what the back look like. I got it like that. I'm gonna have, this is fine. I'm gonna have hair my hair done. Here is a head tie. I could wear it on my head. Looking like I'm going to the gym. Or I could wear it on my face. You know. Pull up in a brand new Benza. Pop on fresher than a Benza. Okay, to the next outfit. I don't really like the jean. I mean the uh, shorts with this top. I have some more jeans. That is, um, is it cuts in this too? Yeah, but they're not as bad. I feel like these would look better. So I might, um. Instead of these, I'm going to wear these ones. But I don't know what shoe I will wear yet. I'll probably figure it out there. I'm probably leaning towards. Okay, here the next fit. Like, this is cute. I might I might wear this purse. This purse I got. With this outfit. Ah! <sighs> I wish I had a freaking body. But these are the shoes. The other shoes that I was debating on. I got this hat right here. Oh, fuck. I was either going to wear this hat, so it was going to be either this hat, you know, with my purse. Ah, it's going to be so cute. My jewelry, of course, and my shades, of course. Or, this one's bigger. In like, more like, my speed, honey. Okay, so here is the next outfit. Uh, it's like, oh, it's a swimsuit, obviously. What am I going to say? I don't know where I would wear this too, but it just really depends when I'm out there on how I'm feeling. But, okay, here is the next one. This one, oh, I didn't even look at myself first. It's decent. Ain't nothing really wrong with it. It's just something simple, simple. Yeah, these shoes is a little bit too, no, they're not a little bit too small. These are too small. But, yeah, and these are shoes. Um, I think that they match. Let me see. These is more comfortable. I kind of like how this looks. Better. These shoes better. I like this better. It's like more subtle. And with these shades, I don't know. Ryan Little. <laughs> Yoga.
Okay, I don't know how much I've seen. I didn't know where it cut off at, but y'all. Here it is. I put my night clothes. Um, everything. I think I pulled out my deodorant. And little, I just, it's a lot of outfits in here. That's, that's what the problem is. Because I just want to be too, sh I want to be, um, set. But I'm obviously very much set. <sighs> All that's left is my carry-on. I carry on, I'm gonna have um, my computer, stuff like that. But everything else is pretty much done. Um, today's the first, I leave the second. So I packed two days before. Um, I need to take my melatonin. I need my melatonin. Just in case I don't be going to sleep and I need to do something the next day. Y'all, I was gonna leave the hats. Dang, I keep gonna bust my ass. How do I put these in there without crushing them? You can't. So it's gonna do it like that. Yeah, and toothpaste and stuff, you know, we're going we're gonna to get that. Get to that stuff, because I still got some a few days to be here. Oh. I hope this ain't 50 pounds. Let's see if I can kind of pick it up with one hand. If I can pick it up with one hand, this damn show ain't 50 pounds. Yeah. This ain't 50 pounds. Okay. Good morning, guys. Today is the next day, the 1st of December. It is finally the Christmas month, and I'm so excited. It's my birthday month, and this is just the best month of the year all the time. Only thing is to be cold. That's the only thing, but I'm here this morning. It is currently 11.26. I'm so excited because I'm going to go get my nails done, and she do pretty good, and they last a long time, so let's see how long they last on me. Yeah, so I have to be there at 12. It's seven minutes away. It's at Kennesaw State. So, I don't have to be rushing to get there or whatever, but I'm going to leave it like um, 11.45. Yeah. What I'm about to do is go ahead and wash my face and brush my teeth. So, this is my plan. So, I just booked my wax appointment for 3.30. So, she do my nails at um 2. Maybe she'll be done at the late. I mean, at 12. Maybe she'll be done at the latest 2. And then I can go ahead and get my feet done. I want to get two acrylic toes on my big toes because I just never had it before. And I just want to try it. So that's what I'm going to do. And I already got a pedicure two days ago. I don't know if I told y'all that or not, but I got a pedicure. I already had it in vlogging because I really didn't think about it. Yeah, I'm so freaking excited. I don't know why I'm excited. I need my retainer. I'm wearing my retainer all day today because no baby. Well, we had it time, but it was time. And then once I get my nails and my... Um, feet done and my wax done. I'm gonna come back here and that's when I'm gonna do my hair. And it should be like what? 4 4 30 ish. I got this head dead wig I'm gonna put on because, honey, I don't wanna wear my body and I don't, not, my hair ain't done. So, this is fine. Like, this looks dead, like, regular, like, maxi bun hair style like what oh look y'all so my appointment is booked for my hair on the second well tomorrow y'all gonna see me get my hair done tomorrow ah! if i come do this video oh maybe i don't know Woo, let's go i gotta take the trash to the trash so let me tell y'all what i did last night omg don't judge me oh she gotta walk to the trash oh no it's cold out here today Yesterday, so I came home yesterday, and if you live here, you know, like, like the parking is like terrible. I couldn't really find a parking spot, so I, spot, I parked in a reserve, which you're not supposed to park here unless you pay for it. But I had to because I wasn't finna walk with all them bags that I had. So I was like, okay, let's park here. And I was turning, and I knew I was too close to the car. And guess what I did? But don't hit the car. The car moved and everything. And I was just like, oh lord. Well, let me take my trash out. Hold on. Left. So the appointment said so I'll be there at 1157. Grinding to find a building. I just can't believe I freaking hit that car. Like that's what gets me. But guys, I'm so happy. Like everything's going smoothly now. Versus yesterday. Yesterday I was crying. I didn't vlog that part because I would not vlog myself crying. So everything goes smoothly, guys. Pray for me for my flight. I mean, by the time y'all see this, I don't know yet. I don't know if I'm gonna be I don't know if I'm gonna upload this stuff after I come back or before, but 
podcast. I'm gonna say something that's like not too TMI. It's just like my life. So y'all know I do YouTube and um, a business and a little other stuff or whatever. So I get paid pretty much, you know, every few weeks, every month, depending on what it, what it's from. So by the end of the month, if I don't spend money, then I have my full income for that month in my account, right? So now that I started doing last year, I see a huge increase, and I'm just like. Well, it's never really the same every month because I'm an entrepreneur. Like, I don't have a job. I don't get pay stubs. But it's always usually, like, around, like, not no drastic difference. But since I've been doing lashes, and I haven't even charged a full price, it's been a drastic difference. So I'm trying to think if I still want to continue to do lashes or what. Like, after I move out of this apartment, I'm not Stay doing lashes. Right two lanes. I'm not doing them home base because... The home I'm gonna be at when I start doing lashes, if I leave Kennesaw, is gonna be a home that's permanent. Okay, girl. It's a home that's gonna be permanent, so I don't want y'all to know that. I don't care if y'all know where I stay at right now, honestly, because I don't, because it's, it's not, um, it's not permanent, it's very temporary. So, I don't really know, so maybe I should just stack, stack, stack until I move out of this apartment. Then that's what I'm gonna do, so I'll stop doing lashes like next year. Um, and then I might turn into a fully instructor instructors instructor only for, i don't know and then like if i have clients that was regular i might travel but they don't have to, to pay me because that's far to travel or if i'm last take i don't know yet but i'll figure it out that's just my plans because i've seen a huge increase and that's great what do you mean i could use that money to just stack up in my savings it's like for emergencies later in life something's in my eyeball Alright y'all, so I'm in the deck. Something's in my fucking eye. Hold up now. I think it's a slash. Both of my inner corners is doing Ah! I just pulled my fucking lash. That shit hurts so bad. Whatever, I have to go up here. So let me put my mask on. It's something in my eye. Two more minutes to an hour credit card. Should I really do that? I'm not doing it because what the fuck? So it says pop in or not pop your dead, baby. There's pop pop spot. Hello? When I'm here, do I come into this elevator area? No. Do I go in the elevator or no? No. No, no. So where am I supposed to go?
<laughs> Yoga. Ryan Little <laughs> Yoga Done my nails I think that they look good I didn't get them like too long Let me turn it around I didn't get them like super long or nothing Because I can't function with long Bro, I'm gonna show you when I get outside But right now I'm just leaving I gotta find my way back to my car Cause Punch out Mm-mm Living on campus probably would not be for me because the guests could not find me. Now I'm gonna head to the um, foot, I mean nail salon to get my feet done because yeah, I didn't get my feet done because y'all know the teeth on that already. Wait a minute, bitch. I'm at the wrong place area. Okay, let me show y'all my nose. Yeah, see? Super cute. Okay, I saw my battery finna die like, what the fuck? I just charged this shit all last night. That's giving me bad vibes. I need to find, that's what I need to do. I need to go buy me a second charger for my camera. I mean, a second battery for my camera because my battery be dying too fast, clearly. But, yeah, so I showed up my nails. And I finna head to the nail salon, the feet, to get my feet done. And then after I get my feet done, I'm gonna wax. Japan! Okay guys, so I'm home now and guess what? We're getting roommates. Two. Two roommates. And it's I don't really know. But anyway, so here's my nail. Let me show y'all my feet. I didn't show y'all my feet because <clears throat> see them? Yes, sir. This is one. This is two. And my fingernails. I just cleaned up my lash area. I don't know what to do with that, so it might have to stay. And she's supposed to be moving in. Well, one of the posts moving moving in today, but it's nevertheless. I'm gonna go ahead and eat. I'm gonna eat me some food and let my phone charge some, and I'm gonna go to the mall. We haven't had roommates since September, so we went two months. Please, hopefully they're cool or whatever. I think that's gonna be it for today and I get my hair done tomorrow morning so that'll be oh tonight I gotta go to my mom's as my hair appointment is over there this is gonna be good I'm excited I did my mask and everything last night face looking not never mind but besides this um I'm finna pop it honestly at this point all right where am I going I'm going to the car wash. okay so I met them or whatever they seem cool decent anyways but um, I'm finna head to, where am I going first? Cause I need to either go to the car wash or to the mall. I think I'm gonna go to the mall first and just go see if they got me a, like a red. I don't know if I want, I don't know what color, but I want a long sleeve dress. I'm finna call Shalaya 
I just have to delay it just for a little bit, but the mall pretty much is right here. It's not like a, a long drive or nothing like that. That is ghetto. Somebody needs to call the police. <laughs> I'm at the mall now. I don't even know what store I'm going to. Like, I look nasty. I'm gonna go to Rainbow first because they got cheap price and they might have something cute before I start roaming this whole mall. Furry. Oh, here goes some. Here is a red one, but that's not cute. What about this? Um, is their dressing room open? This is hecka cute. It's a medium. I don't know, I think the medium too big. Did you like the moisturizer too, the lotion? Yeah, but it's not free. <sighs> so I just bought, bought freaking the skincare thing for $106, but it was originally $150. So, I mean, I got a deal and it's really good. Like, I wish I would have vlogged her doing it, but because she said she didn't want me to go out, so I didn't do it. But that was pretty cool. So I, she gave me. I bought one for 99 and I got one for free, so I got a more sh no, no, no. I got a body scrub and this gel for my face that like clean it. I'm gonna do this tonight for this damn pimple, and we're just gonna see. Hi, yeah. We just came from that, and we just bought that same thing. I was that part of it, but this is our first time here. She did the same thing to me. Okay, so <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Uh, it looked good, it's so. Good. so I'm like, I'm gonna try it. We bought the whole thing. Yeah, me too. Do the whole thing. She got me to do it. But. Yeah, I thought that's what we thought. Yeah, no. But it looked good, so. Yeah. But I put them together now, they look the same. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> you too. So I guess she convinced them to. Oh, she said go to Windsor. Windsor. Mm, she was a lion. This stuff is nice. Okay, guys. So y'all seen? Sorry, I took my wig off. I'm at home now. But y'all seen um, when I had bought that thing from that place? Like, I didn't even go in there. She, like, was one of those people that be standing outside. And she started a nice conversation with me. And she said, let me show you something so you can vlog. Because I had my camera on. Or, or I didn't have it on, but I had it. It was this little facial cleanser and a scrub. I'm going to use it today. I'm scared. But first things first, I have to wash my face. So she gave me this bar of soap for free. This one I'm going to wash my face with. Bruh. If I can open it. So I'm just going to wash my face real fast with this bar of soap. And I just hope it do what it's supposed to do. So here's the stuff. This is originally $150 freaking dollars. But I got it for $99. And then I got the body scrub free, which I'm going to use when I get in the shower. He said, don't put your hands in it. So we have very, we have bacteria under our nails. So it's forever flawless. That is the company name. And so she said, just scoop a little oh, this way. Oh, how it's supposed to go. Then you just rub it. Ew, no way. It's going to be a whole bunch of dead skin coming off my face in the feel. All that stuff is dead skin. Oh my goodness. She's told me. I don't know if that's the truth. She said use it once a week. And after this, I have to use a moisturizer. I'm going to just use this. She said don't rinse it. Just swipe away. Look at my face. Like, it looks brighter. Pimples did there, but no cap. My face looks brighter. So, 8 out of 10 for the first night. And let me just go ahead and take a shower and get ready. Because my reservation is at 745. And I think that's going to be the end of this video. I'm going to do a get ready with me for the dinner. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe, I don't know, maybe, maybe. Hey guys, so I went to dinner and I'm back. I didn't vlog because I actually was got, I got rushed. Here I am, back home. I didn't take pictures. It was race. I had on some new tan heels. But right now I'm cleaning my room up and I'm going to see y'all tomorrow morning when I finally get my hair done. Hey, good morning. So it is currently, I don't know, but I need to go to this hair appointment. Yeah, it says I'm going to get there at 11.27. The appointment is at 11.30, so hopefully... 
This time don't go up and I'll be there on time. I need to take my hair out though while we go. I'm ready to see like it's almost time. My birthday's tomorrow at 12. Turn like, left, then turn right hair. onto Hidden Forest Court. Shit, I still got glue on it. So I got glue, I thought I got all the glue off, but obviously not. I think I have a 20 minute grace period, so um, that'll help me if anything. I don't know my other lip gloss in, my lips are dry. Anywho, I don't even know what I was just saying. Y'all, I still need to get cash out to pay her, but if all fails, she gonna have to take this cash out for her. But I got a few cash, a little bit of cash right here, but I know this ain't 250, so I'll have to go to the bank and pull out the remainder, but I'm gonna count this, what shit? I'm gonna count this, so hold up. <laughs> okay, y'all. So I'm done. Ah, it's so cute. I'm so excited. So 
Now I'm gonna be headed to my mama's to see her. And then I'm gonna go with her around wherever we go. Then we're gonna be off to my dad's. And then that's gonna be the end of this vlog, honey. I'm gonna end it tonight because I'm gonna do my last preparations, which I'm gonna just make sure. I mean, pack the rest of my stuff that I got. <laughs> Look at this, honey. So, I'll put her Instagram on the screen if you're near Atlanta or the cat. I mean, yeah, the cat. Like, don't you all that stuff? You could go get your hair done. I paid four twenty five for the wig and the install and the style, baby. That's good. So, because it's 28, 28 inch. A little toasty. It's hot. Hell no. I'm hungry, so um, when I want my mama, we're gonna go get some food because I'm already knowing. Oh, you know, and she's gonna get her baby girl some food. Kiri. But guys, I'm really gonna go to freaking Mexico for my 18th birthday. Like, people don't do this. It's crazy to me. Uh, we are blessed that we are able to do this. Um, it was a few ups and downs, but you know, still love here. But it's okay because this is just one out of many trips with my friends. So it doesn't really matter. I mean, it do matter, but it's okay. Hurry up, motherfucker. <laughs> I hate myself. Guys, I be playing. When I be, like, cussing excessively like that, I don't be dead for real. Ew. Fucking man. Y'all, he's pulling up with me. Yeah, 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 we pay. Yeah, 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 we pay. Oh, fuck. Now he's coming again. Leave me alone. Move, bitch. Get the fuck out of my face. Like men are too bold. They are too bold. They feel too much power over women. When I turn 21, I swear, I swear, I'm flashing my shit on all these niggas. <laughs> it just made me upset. Like he was doing too much. I hate boys. It'd be the car video for me. That's what it'd be for me. Okay. Okay, guys, I'm at my family's house. And let's see what they got for me. Hey! 
y'all leave, did y'all want to tell her? You know, God bless. Be safe. Thank you. We love you. We love you. Love you too. Don't get killed now. Do everybody have any advice? Let me say that then, one at a time. Let that tell you don't get up there. Get out. Hey guys, so as you can see, I had a great pre-birthday, but now it is officially it's officially my birthday. It is 12, 11 a.m. So it's your girl's birthday, December 3rd, <sighs> period. But that's going to be the end of this vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed everything. My get ready with me and all of that jazz. So thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one, which I got to vlog again right in, right in the morning because it's my birthday. <sighs> so bye guys.